night, I smell to event has continued. And we are now starting to see what Epic Games has been trying to hide. But first, here at Ruined Reels, a major storyline map change has taken place. A telescope has appeared with the iconic Valera book and chair. Yeah, this is the same book that used to be found at Boss Valera's location. The same book that had drawings of some kind of secret box artifact that we believed is the cursed Pandora's box. Hey, yo, this ain't no joke, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is 100% Valera's book that was at her location. Yo, and that's the secret artifact. I don't know, we can get a better look. Oh, that's, oh, that's so much better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the reason why this is so important in Fortnite right now is because this is the first major storyline map change that has literally been added into Chapter 5. And it confirms that... It's time to... Uh, what was bro looking at? Ever since I became a rat, people be looking at me funny. And it confirms that Valera is definitely on the move. She's definitely searching for this mysterious artifact. And it looks like it's, uh, somewhere in that direction over there. Yo, can we take a look into this? Yo, can we take a look? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Check this out. If we are to follow the line of sight to where the telescope is looking, it takes us straight to the Ship It Express Depot, which is known for delivering parcels around our Chapter 5 island. At first glance, this location seems pretty harmless. But in the latest updates, when you look a little deeper, the truth is revealed. Ship It Express was featured in the Winterfest LTM with quests, confirming that it had some role to play in Fortnite's storyline. But deep inside this location, players can see a bunch of boxes all over this location. So if uh, Valera is looking for some kind of secret artifact, it's uh, probably inside one of these boxes. Uh, hey, bro, you seen Pandora's box? No! Bro's trash. If Epic Games is hiding a secret legendary artifact in this location, there's only one way to find out. That's by busting them all open, huh? I highly doubt it's gonna be in one of these. These this, this doesn't seem like there's gonna be an artifact. Oh, dude, look at this. This one's being held up by some kind of device. Maybe there's something in here. No! I'm gonna have to bash through all these darn boxes, aren't I? I wanna find this box so badly. I gotta find it before Valera. Nope. Damn! Where do these items come from? In my lucky day. Yeah, I'm gonna quickly try and destroy all the boxes right now, so this may take a moment. Because if Pandora's box is hidden here, Epic Games won't leave it anywhere obvious. Players online have identified this locked box to fit the description of Pandora's box, which is an old Greek myth about a box when opened, releases misfortune and evil into the world. This mysterious Greek box can be found drawn into the book that is being studied by Valera. Could this ancient box drawn into this book be hidden in our Fortnite islands? And could it be a part of Chapter 5 Season 2 storyline? Yeah, bro, we still at it right now. We still at it. Just, just bear with us, dog. We're gonna get there one way or another. This is the direction that Valera is looking. So, Epic Games is definitely hiding something at this location. Bro, is that them all? I think that's literally all of them, right? Are there any outstanding boxes? Aha! Oh, there's a big one here. Yo, look the size of this one. This is the biggest box, right? You know, it's got a label on it. Did any other boxes have a label on it? I don't think so. Uh, three, two, one. Yo. 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 Huh? Wait a minute. Is that what Valera is looking for? Is that the Damn box? Pandora's box? Ah, no. No, there is literally nothing here right now at this express ship it location. Whatever Valera is looking for, I'm sure it's about to be added into game. But for the meantime, there are even bigger map changes on our islands that you really need to see. The giant ice wall is still melting in Fortnite. And this time, we know what is underneath. We have been following the secret map changes at the ice wall in chapter 5. First, water started dripping down the side of the wall. Then, of course, the crashed plane started sliding down the mountain and moving every single update. But now, the biggest map changes have appeared, and you need to see it. Once again, the plane has moved, and it's on its second to last stage. And it's now hanging off the edge of the ice cliff. Presumably, in the next update, this ice wall will melt down to the point where this plane will finally slide off the edge and into the water. What will happen when this plane lands in the water? Well, I'm excited to find out. Hey, yo, sorry to bother. Remember, if you guys want to support this channel, you could use the supporter creator code that is on screen right now. This directly helps me and keeps the channel going. If you haven't added anyone's name, hey, why not me, huh? Hey, thanks, guys. Not only this, if you come down to the ice wall location, you can actually see Snowheart. An icy NPC was added in the most recent updates. And when you speak to her, she says, nothing shall deter 
me. The road I travel is my own. Ice can burn if you are not careful. And under the ice is your worst nightmare. <laughs> Sorry, that last one was cat. But the rest of them were 100% real. Oh, look, when the storm comes, find safety. That's a new one. How many of these have you got? I see, uh, I see go, ice heart, ice, uh, ice whatever. Ice can burn, yeah, we've seen that one. Ice can burn, yeah, we've seen, yeah. The road to travel is my own. Yeah, okay, I think we got through them all. Snow Heart seems to be an ice queen, and she's been placed right outside the giant ice wall that is currently melting. She's given us a bunch of warnings about ice burning, and when the storm comes, we gotta head to safety. What you may not realize is this is actually a clue to what is coming in season two. Snow Heart is a character based off of a Greek theme, and she's made of ice. We already know in the next upcoming season, we are expecting a Greek god's theme to be coming to game. Fortnite is adding a new boss in chapter five, and he seems to have some kind of mythic thunder power. In the game's files, players have uncovered an upcoming Zeus-style boss, which has some kind of lightning attack ability. Zeus is the thunder god in Greek mythology, and players now believe he is about to be added into Fortnite as a boss for players to battle with in-game. This might explain why Snowheart says when the storm comes, get to safety. In the official Fortnite outfit survey, many Greek-style outfits can be found waiting to be added into game. Does this mean that we're getting a Greek-themed update in Chapter 5? Well, it seems almost certainly so. I don't know about you, it seems pretty obvious to me that whatever is under the ice has something to do with this Greek theme, and the arrival of Snow Hearts and the melting ice just goes to prove it. Yo! Oh my goodness, bro. I love hoverboards, dog. Hoverboards are my favorite. I did not actually know... <laughs> hey, yo, I did not know they actually added hoverboards back into the game. This part of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle thing, right? It's <laughs> it! Oh no, bro, that is insanely unlucky. You gotta feel bad for him. Bro, how are they doing so much damage? That's nuts! Okay, I got one slurp barrel. Let me just take that bot. Yep, we good the- Bro, I'm telling you, dog. You know when I complain about my game lagging? I am not joking. Something is wrong with Fortnite. <laughs> hey, don't mind me. Apparently, you now have to charge up your hoverboard. Pretty cringe, I think pretty cringe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks. Oh, damn! I didn't know these were in the game right now. Yo, bro, we got crazy items, dog. Got Valyria's SMG, which is the best item in the game. Yo, I got Raphael, Raphael's uh, spinning stuff. Hey, yo, we lit. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? You ain't ever seen anything. Ah, uh, I'm finished. Bro, my damage sucks. Uh, yeah, I don't know what's going on with those mythics. Maybe it had something to do with the fact that I was on a hoverboard. I don't know. I'm going to just play it on the safe side and say the mythics are garbage. I'll let you know if I change my mind. Your trust 